Well, good morning, everyone. It's me, Dwayne the Donkey, and I'm here in the sanctuary, but I know that you aren't. I know it's so that we all stay healthy, but I miss you all a lot. I was telling Pastor Brad how much I miss seeing everyone. Uh, like usually, I get to talk with Miss Jenny on Sunday mornings, and he said I could use this computer to FaceTime with her. Siri, call Jenny. Hang on, guys, I got a call. <gasps> Dwayne, it's so good to see you. Oh, I'm so glad to see you too. It's really different and a little hard to be celebrating Easter in different places. I know. I have a lot of feelings too. Did you know that there were a lot of feelings on the very first Easter too? Well, there were a lot of feelings? I know I'm happy on Easter. So if there were a lot of feelings, I bet they were joyful, excited, and jubilant. Those are all good words to describe the happy feelings. But that isn't how the day started. How the day started? When Jesus' friends woke up that morning, they were sad, frustrated, and scared. Their friend Jesus has, had died only three days before. They thought he was gone forever. Well, that's how Easter started? Well, that's not jubilant at all. That's how it started, yes. We often only think of Easter as a day filled with happy words. But what makes Easter so special and so real is where the day started. To start the day thinking that life was over and then to find out that Jesus was alive? That's amazing. It is amazing, Duane. God used Easter to show us that God's love is more powerful than anything. Jesus coming back to life was God showing us that nothing can separate us from God's love and that God does new beginnings. God can even make new beginnings out of the difficult and sad places in life. That sounds important to remember. It is. That's why we celebrate Easter every year. And just like the woman at the tomb on the very first Easter, we not only get to hear the good news, we get to share it. Well, share it? We can share it every day in how we live, Duane. And on Easter, we also share it with words. The traditional Easter greeting is Christ is risen. And someone responds, he is risen indeed. Ooh, 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 let me try it. Hey, hey, Miss Jenny, Christ is risen. He is risen indeed, Dwayne. I want to tell some more friends. Who does Pastor Brad have in his address book? Oh, happy Easter, Charlotte. Christ is risen. Happy Easter, Dwayne. He is risen indeed. Mm, oh, that was great. Oh, who else is in here? Oh, Miss Ellie, it's so good to see you. Happy Easter. Christ is risen. Happy Easter, Dwayne. He is risen indeed. Oh, that was great, too. Oh, 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 hi, Lucy. Christ is risen. Happy Easter, Dwayne. He is risen, risen indeed. Oh, boy, this, this is awesome. I love sharing the good news of Easter and seeing so many people. Hey, I recognize that name. Oh, Bishop Karen. Happy Easter. Christ is risen. Happy Easter, Dwayne. He is risen indeed. Oh, let's try one more. Uh, let, well, let's see. Who else can we call? Oh, Happy Easter, Mayor Hancock. Christ is risen. Happy Easter, Dwayne. He is risen indeed. Oh, that was wonderful. Oh, I'm still a little sad that I'm not with everybody in person. I'm happy that I got to share the good news of Easter with my friends. Dwayne, even celebrations like Easter can have mixed emotions, where parts of us are happy and other parts of us are sad, or feeling excited and a little anxious, or feeling uncertain and hopeful. Easter is about God showing up in the middle of all of our feelings being with us, and showing us life. Well, 
Thanks, Miss Jenny. Happy Easter. Happy Easter to you too, Dwayne. And remember, Christ is risen. Oh, he is risen indeed. Uh, would you like to lead our prayer? I would love to lead our prayer. Dear God. Dear God. We are grateful. We are grateful. That Easter arrives. That Easter arrives. To bring us life. To bring us life. Help us remember. Help us remember that nothing can separate us that nothing can separate us from your love from your love may we share the good news may we share the good news of your love for everyone of your love for everyone and may i always remember and may i always remember that you love me that you love me. Amen. Amen. All right, kiddos, let's do our children's motto together. In all, all that, that we think, think in all, all that we say, in all, in all that we do, may we glorify, glorify you. you. Amen. Amen. Happy Easter, everyone.